Well, hello, thank you for joining me. These are the announcements for the Tomorrow River Lutheran Parish for July 11th, 2021. That is the seventh Sunday after Pentecost. So uh, we continue to have the three opportunities for in-person worship. At the moment, COVID is, uh, is very, very low in the county. Uh, and so uh, you are welcome to come to worship. We, we believe it to be safe and we hope uh, that you will, uh, that you'll come and that you'll remember uh, the discipline that used to characterize your life, that you would be regular uh, for divine services in the house of the Lord. So we have an 8.30 service indoors at at Peace, we have uh, a 9.30 service outdoors at Nelsonville and a 10.15 service indoors at Nelsonville. Remember for the 9.30 service, you should bring your own lawn chair. Uh, Google says that it's going to be about 68 degrees and lovely uh, with just a light breeze on Sunday morning. I hope that pans out. I hope that's in fact what we get. Uh, but it would be lovely to see you at any of these worship opportunities opportunities. You do not need to pre-register anymore. Now pre-registering has one purpose. It helps us to know that you've been in worship, uh, which keeps your voting membership alive. So periodically, uh, you should pre-register just so that we know, uh, just so that uh, you can uh, continue to, to uh, do your work and to take your place uh, as we make decisions together. Uh, but that, that is that. You are welcome to come whether you have signed up in advance or not. Prayer list. As far as I know, everything uh, on the prayer list this week has been on in uh, weeks previous. We still have uh, the Dow family in the uh, first initial immediate stages of grief and so we continue to remember Bonnie and the kids uh, during this time uh, but everyone else you've seen we do have an update though uh, about Axton the the five-year-old with leukemia his treatment has been going well uh, he's doing better he is now in a maintenance phase of his treatment thanks be to God uh, for uh, for God's healing mercies there everything else uh, is as it was and I just continue to commend them these people to you uh, for your prayers and for your uh, your acts of mercy and kindness uh, and generosity as you interact with them there is an opportunity for confirmands to pick up church service hours on Wednesday, July 21st at 1230. We're going to be oiling the pews at Peace. So whether you're a Nelsonville kid or a Peace kid, if you want church hours, show up at 1230 on Wednesday, the 21st, and we will uh, we'll be glad for your help uh, and for your work. Now, big people can come, too. It, it, it's not limited to confirmands. They have to do some, some work in the church. But... If you want to come and, and help uh, care for the property here, we'd love to see you Wednesday the 21st at 1230. Uh, as we uh, talked about last week, Bethany Home in Wapaka is looking for uh, employees for every department. This is a nursing home that back in the day, uh, this congregation or these congregations, both Peace and Nelsonville founded. Uh, we're part of the, uh, of the original group of churches that formed the Bethany home. And so uh, they reached out to us to let us know that they are in need of good and decent employees. And if that's you or someone you know, give them a call. It is an important job caring for our aged, for our elders. The Synod Golf Tour, or a tour, maybe it'll grow into a tour. The Synod Golf Tournament is coming up. If you've ever wanted to skunk a bishop at golf, this is your big chance. You have to sign up before July 25th. The tournament itself is on August 10th. There's registration forms available either on our website or the Synod website. 60 bucks gets you, uh, gets you your green fees, gets you a cart, gets you lunch, and gets you uh, prizes. So uh, we, uh, we remind you of that. That. The Synod is currently posting every week a little video about what the bishop's been up to. If you've wondered what a bishop does uh, with his or her life, uh, you can now find out. You can now follow Bishop Ann uh, as she travels around the Synod and see what she is up to. Those bishops are on our, those bishops, those videos are on our website and on the bishop's website. So uh, take a look at those. We're working on school kits, personal care kits, and baby kits in 
the two churches, there's a link at the top of the website called Care Kits. You click that, it shows you exactly what we're collecting. Or if you prefer to make your own kits, exactly how to do it. Remember, creativity is not a bonus. Do it exactly as the directions indicate, and that keeps peace as these are passed out around the world. Finally, the quilters and uh, track continue to do their work. If you want to help with either one of those endeavors, that help is always appreciated. And if you come across people uh, around you or in your family that are in need of food, we have food. And it would be our honor to serve you, to serve them. Just let us know. Just show up Monday mornings, Thursday evenings. Those are the announcements for this week. I do thank you for your kind attention, and I thank you for all that you do to support these churches and all you do to honor Christ in your lives and with your obedience. May God bless, protect, and keep you. Bye-bye.